Friday's Telegraph with a potential bump in the road for Liz Truss. Sajila, is this a good idea? OK, so Liz Truss hints that she could axe the motorway speed limits. Um, now, the Tory front runner. Uh, God, is it not over yet? Please, man. <laughs> I can't bear any more of this. It's weeks and weeks and weeks. No, only a week to go. A few days. <laughs> only a few days. Well, we know it's going to be her. Um, so basically, she's, she's pledging to ban the smart motorways. Um, now, I don't know about you, but I don't trust the smart motorways because I believe in the hard shoulder, which should be the hard shoulder that we can all cry on when we have a breakdown <laughs> on the motorway. <laughs> so, um, yeah, and she's also thinking of getting rid of the uh, speed limit and, and basically allowing people to go at the speed that they want, which I think is a terrible idea. We need boundaries. What's with, you know, this is going to cause, like, terrible, you know, disruption and people are just going to drive around like lunatics and uh, we can't trust people. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. The, 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 there's a lot of different theories about this because if you have faster drivers on, fast, on, on lanes on the outside, uh, then they get off the motorways faster, so you actually have fewer people on the road at any one time. So it does kind of make sense. And also, while speed does make an accident worse, it, the thing that causes accidents is bad driving. What we really need is better driving on motorways. Yeah, but that's not even covered properly on driving courses, and it should be. Yeah, but Those that's not going to be covered idiots, with the uh, speed limit, though. Like, if, you've, if, you, if you say, right, you can drive at any speed, if you're a bad driver, you're going to drive, drive badly and at the wrong speed. I learned, to, I learned sure. to drive at a time when driving was fun, and I romanticised this in a way that I, it was proper cowboy, you know. We had no seat belts, there was no secret policemen, there were no cameras. You could uh, smoke and drink you at you the could same smoke time. And drink. The police, police would pull you over, they were breathless. <laughs> You, and if you hadn't drunk enough, they would give you a drink. That's how much fun it was back then. Um, oh, so then were the I know, look, a lot of people died, but nevertheless, it was fun driving. And we do have some of the safest roads in Europe already. Yeah, yeah. Well, let's keep yeah. them safe. But um, nah. normally they have motorways where <laughs> yeah, you do. get to your own speed and they're not necessarily that. The, the rule is that the, the quicker you go, the more liable you will be in the event of an accident. So, yeah. yes. so it, it yeah. levels out. And it's worth saying as well that the way the Telegraph's looked at this story, saying Liz Truss will get rid of smart motorways, Rishi Sunak said that as well. Yes. So smart motorways, bye. Yeah, they'll definitely, they're both in agreement well, with Well, that's happening here is that obviously the Telegraph are, are going back behind Liz Truss yeah. and saying, look, we know she's going to win, so we're just, Liz, we're on your, we're on your team, we're on your fan, but, but please let this be over. I can't bear any more of this. It's ridiculous. It also so feels, nothing for the Tory party. also feels like just saying stuff that people are going to love. We'll get rid of speed limits. We'll bring back those sweets, yeah, you remember. it's just nonsense. It's just nonsense. Oh, we'll give you, we'll give you mini milks, free mini milks to everybody. That'd it's be like, nice, though. You're obsessed nice. with milk. Are you I love mini milks. Yeah. Okay. Uh,